DePaul smart defensively, does a lot of switching. UConn has to communicate. Beckers with the steal. And the first points of the game to Page. Four. Beckers, yes, that's a three. First made three. Beckers feeds Nelson and Dota, knocked away. She gets it back, puts it in. Nice pass by Beckers. This young freshman is so good of getting in the lane and finding the open teammate. Good active hands. Nice pass. And Beckers drains the three. Really good play there, so hard. Both are very scrappy. Game's got a nice intensity to it. Beckers. 4-3. Page Peppers. Five timeout. Beckers on fire from beyond the arc. Two, three of four from outside. DePaul so active with their hands defensively. We got three seconds called because the bodies were still on the floor. <laughs> and UConn. This is where he's glad the mask is on so no one can read his lips. And he's saying to her, listen, you're not, you're not looking to shoot. And yet, Beckers is the leading scorer for the Huskies. But uh, triple teamed when there's three people in there. So I don't know why you would, you know, pass up a wide open shot to pass the ball. Uh, so it makes no sense to me. And, uh, you know, sometimes I just... You know, I see things um, that I've never seen before. And, uh, Smart play by Nelson Adota to keep that alive. Yeah. Nice pass. Shot wouldn't go, but Olivia draws the foul. Nelson Adota frustrated that she missed that shot, but the nice pass. She wanted to make that. She claps her hands in frustration. Ball so stays yeah. UConn ball. Ten to shoot. Beckers to Nelson Adota. Back to Beckers. Nice movement without the basketball. And a turnover to UConn. You, know, you, never, you can't ever get stopped watching the play. It's not enough. Nice job. When it, when it Ten to shoot. Beckers. That was from outside the men's three-point line, I believe. And comes back and gets the steal. The draw of the foul. Unheld. That'll be four unheld. She almost didn't go for the steal. And then held. Held tried. You know, Held did the game. Beckers with misses. 0 for 2 from the free throw stripe tonight. She's done a lot of other things well, though. There's Rogers. Dumps it into the lane. Allen kind of hesitated on the way to the rim with a lot of traffic closing in. Nice and Baccarat runs ahead of the pack. Yeah, Puno's calling a timeout, not liking what he's seeing. Turning defense into offense, running the floor. Beckers finds Makarov for a bucket. Timeout to Paul. Morris gets away from McLean, shot too strong. And McLean comes up with a rebound, feeds Beckers. Beckers splits defenders, couldn't get the shot to fall. This is what Gino wants her to do. It's always good to do it in a, a break opportunity because the defense isn't set. Fourth 
definitely has um, has put the numbers up on the board. Olivia has set a season high in rebounds tonight, and here comes Paige Beckers out of the game in favor of Nika Mule. 18 points, 6 of 15 shooting, 4 of 6 as the Huskies pull away from DePaul for a 23-point win, 75-52. The final, the Huskies hold DePaul scoreless for the last 3 minutes and 32 seconds of this ball game and limit the Blue Demons to just 25% shooting from the floor. The 47th season of UConn women's basketball is about to begin, finally. The UMass Lowell River Hawks are in town to take on the Huskies, live from Gamble. Understandable, she had a spectacular high school career. Now coming in as a heralded freshman, well, we've seen that over the years here at UConn. But for Gina Oriema to say, I knew she was really good, <laughs> and through these many practices that they have had, he said, She's better than I thought she was. So those are some big words from him. And I'm excited to watch this kid play. I mean, we haven't been able to see much practice at all, yeah. uh, the, you know, this preseason. So I'm excited like everyone else is to see her play. She passes the ball spectacularly. Well, Beckers is in the starting lineup today as the Husky. UMass Lowell from the America East Conference. So the squad's uh, just being finished introduced. Starting lineups presented by Subaru. For UConn, the expected group, the returners, Williams, Makarot, and Nelson Adota, uh, accompanied by Avina Westbrook, who'll make her Husky debut, and Paige Beckers, who cracks the starting lineup. And for UMass Lowell, Karis Item, their leading scorer, leading returning scorer as well, and Denise Solis, who's from Windsor, Connecticut, getting uh, the start for the River Hawks here at Gamble Pavilion. Are you excited? I am. I mean, I just, I can't believe we're, we're here. It's we're in Gamble. We're doing this game. We're finally going to watch some basketball. The winter can begin. Inside, blocked. Nelson Adota came over the back of Karis Item with the first block of the season for Olivia. That yeah, was nice help defense by Williams. Nelson Adota. Strong on the three. Beckers with the rebound and the putback. The first Beckers bucket of her UConn career. Question is, how many will you see here the long rebound. Becker's in the right place. Didn't waste time putting the ball on the floor. Yeah, a little 1-2, one, 1-1 one, one pressure. They have more depth this year, does UConn. And the steal, Becker's on the run. In the right place at the right time, Avina Westbrook. First points in a UConn uniform for Avina Westbrook there. Makarov off the pressure gets the steal. Feed from Becker's to Kristen Williams. <laughs> Beckers takes the feed from Makarot, stops, and pops. That step through. He's there to clean it up. Less than a minute to go. First quarter shot from the corner. Shot for Span. It's off the mark. Kristen Williams with the rebound. I've been impressed with UConn's half-court man-to-man -man defense. Olivia Nelson Adota strong to the basket. And all the workouts she did. Turnover again. Here comes Westbrook on the feed from Griffin. She dumps it under the Beckers, who gets fouled and a bucket. Nice unselfish pass there from Westbrook. And we talked about the leadership and things that those upperclassmen can do. Good steal on the break, and then that's what you know, that's what leaders will do: is get your team involved. The guys on the bench loved it. Add to your. 33-point lead. <laughs> Becker's got it. And Paige Becker's caps off a debut opening quarter. Well, nice screen by Nelson Adota, and then a good read by Becker's to slice through the lane, firing the ball around side to side. It really makes it tough for the defense to guard. Just think about it. They're, they're playing a zone because they can't guard you in the first place. Makarov from the corner. See, now we get to add that to our repertoire this year. Is what's he thinking under that mask? <laughs> There's Beckers. Yeah, that was devastating for her and for their team that she couldn't make the trip. Yeah. 
Beckers feeds Gabriel underneath, just couldn't drop it in. <laughs> Terrific pass, just not going to get an assist for it. Knocked away out of bounds from behind by the. Pass kicked away. I guess we're not going to call away. that kick. Beckers with the interception. Good hurry back. Yeah, she hustles on both sides of the floor. It'll be a 56 point margin of victory. And our player of the game is presented by Cadillac. Had to be Paige Beckers, didn't it? Well, I mean, we talked about her off the top of the show, and you never want to, you know, at least I'm just not into overhyping freshmen, so to speak, but she lived up to the hype early. And head coach Shino Ariyama joins us now from... Break, but one thing you have to be with her is you got to be ready to catch a pass. She's an outstanding passer, but already as a young player can read the defense and knows where to go on the floor. Just tremendous instincts. And those instincts will get a test against a very difficult Seton Hall team known for defensive pressure and pace on offense. Bembry, too strong. Beckers fights for the rebound. Good terrific, position. Yeah, terrific inside position by Beckers. Nice pass. Olivia in the lane. Can't get the shot to fall, but does draw the foul. One to injury there. Nice inside position by Beckers and Olivia nelson Adota running the floor. Keep those hands up. The freshman will find you hopes of success in this ball game yeah that was one thing gino told us you know they shoot 30 a game there's beckers on the board jackson pass outbound intercepted by makarat good active hands by makarat on defense beckers will run end to end switches the ball with the right hand and lays it in nice body control good strength by the freshman outside to treadwell too strong Beckers with the rebound. Here comes Makarot on the run. Nice pass to Kristen Williams. And a bucket. And a timeout. Seton Hall. I mean, how about this from Makarot? Right in step. Williams just had to catch. And explode up. And you can just tell she feels more confident. There's Beckers from Williams for two. Subs in the game. Fumbled away, here comes Mule. Ahead to Beckers. Oh, around the back to Griffin, who just couldn't handle it. <laughs> that is not the first of those passes we've seen from Beckers in just and a game in less than you, a half. That shows you what he thinks of it. You know, again, everything, the pace of it, UConn is just a little bit out of sorts. Yeah. See what different combinations on the floor will give the team. Park Lane misses. Nelson Adota gets her... Pass blocked, but right back to Beckers. Up ahead to Edwards. And Elmore had to be careful not to pick up. Standing five. around. Beckers for three. Yes. Looking to expand their lead back to double digits. Beckers feeds. Olivia saw the defender coming. A nice stop and hesitation to get the bucket. Beckers on Park Lane, right to the rim. That's the patience and the the offensive. How about that nice pick and roll, perfect pass, leading her right to the hoop. And then this, I thought, was just really good patience. Seeing good offense, though, by Seton Hall. They got the shot they wanted. Pass ahead to on a Makarot. She'll feed back out to Beckers. Inbound. Nelson Adota with a contested shot. Nice yeah. control. But how about this? In traffic, nice job by Nelson Adota there. Wide open Treadwell. He can't get it to drop. Beckers on the run. No defender anywhere near her. Nelson Adota. Well, that was a little bit of a, a hope for a shot. Beckers had time to set the feet. You see the freshman running the floor. Really good spacing way outside the three-point line. On the inbounds. A 
Leah Edwards has checked into the ball game for UConn for Nelson Agoda. Becker stops and pops. That's, that's her move. We'll do, do the same. Kristen Williams ahead of the defense. Beautiful pass from the field going after struggling a little bit earlier in the game. Beckers to a wide open Kristen Williams. Yes. 5.3 left. Screen by Edwards. End to end for Beckers. Yes! I say that worked well. I mean, what a screen that was. Monster screen by Aaliyah Edwards. Tremendous body control. Beckers with the soft floater that uses a lot of iron. Oh, she was wide open. And waited too late to get that one inside. Intercepted. Here come the Pirates. This will be Jackson. Tied up ball. Lost control of it, kind of a high dribble. And Beckers was there to pass. Kristen Williams left alone, cutting, but couldn't drop in the lane. Out of the locker room and roared. And that has continued here into quarter number four. Paige Beckers to Edwards. Gathered it up and put it in. I tell you, they compete. Beckers. Her game on Saturday, you know, she didn't have a great first half, but she's gutted it out, her first road game. She's made the difference here in the second half. That is going to be a foul underneath on Elmore, and that is going to be it for her fifth foul. So the Hartford, Connecticut native will exit the game. Hey, the kid's tough too, right? Mm -hmm. Took a shot to the cheek. The ball game. And Beckers will exit the stage with 25 points on 11 of 14 shooting. Well, think about it. It's December 15th, and it's their second game. Yeah. So he's going to need to keep the lineup that he wants, you know, the most together, whether it's the starting five and whomever, as you see, Beckers gets the rest for the rest of the night. But. Pat Summit's mark for career wins as his Huskies take on the Providence Friars this afternoon. Our starting lineup is presented by Subaru and the first change in the UConn starting lineup of the season. Anna Makarot comes out and Aaliyah Edwards goes into the starting five. Typical starting five for Providence. Uh, Enfield's Mary Baskerville. Points off of six UConn turnovers in the first six minutes in the game. And Surprised that guy's head hasn't exploded. Well, four of the five starters are on the bench in the lineup. Beckers. Shoot more, score more. Well, right? I mean, it's, it's pretty simple. The charge, that gets teams fired up. That can change the momentum. Three freshmen, two sophomores on the floor now. Makarov from the corner again. Shoot, but this group has done an outstanding job of changing the tempo of the game, bringing a lot of energy. Beckers makes it a 10-0 UConn run. She's saying, I could be a post player. Oh, Griffin with the rebound, that wouldn't fall. Gets another shot at it. McLean fights through the traffic. Nice. Beckers with the block. Edwards got a hand in there also. Good half-court stance there by UConn. Aliyah Edwards runs the floor and Beckers finds the lane. Paige but, Beckers. Yeah, it's just really good find. And, and Edwards... Beckers with the step back. Gino's irate that they're still getting wide open shots. Becker's wide open. See, she would not have shot that a couple games ago. But because Olivia goes back into the ball game. And the option he has this year that he didn't have last year is to bench some kids if he doesn't like the way they're playing. 
Nelson Adota, Beckers, who draws the foul, shooting three. Griffin Westbrook and Makarot, the foul. And games also give you this opportunity, as she did take the shot when Gino... Beckers at the line for the first time today. By the way, the foul on Mary Baskerville. And to commit the foul on the three-point line, trying to help out your team. Nelson Adoda just barely got that pass over Geary. A slow start, not far off the half average. Beckers, nice use of the glass. He had an explosion game against the Butler earlier in the season. 20, put up 28 on the Bulldogs. Nice pass into the paint to Olivia Nelson Adoda. And it's a three. Avina Westbrook for three. Really good patience by UConn on offense. Three seconds and counting. Yuzi Fosa throws it up. That'll be way off the ball. Time. Spurax miss rebounded by Westbrook, whose name we're suddenly calling constantly. Cut by Beckers. Athletic spin will draw the foul. He's done calm. Find out more. Was it? Baskerville, no, Kristen Williams with a nice rebound. Beckers. That's an example where she is now taking shots. Points in the Yukon uniform. Yeah, she's been battling that stress reaction in her foot. Yeah. And but Gino Ariam is so high on her. Beckers got a three there. Perhaps. Beckers with the steal and the run. She's had really great anticipation on that wing several times today. Forced to turn over. Three point lead. As Paige Beckers exits the ball game for UConn with 23 points. Eight of ten shooting. Two of four from three. Five of five from the free throw line. Like a bell cut.